What's up, everyone? We're back with Cooking with Elisa. Don Francisco, my favorite. I love vanilla nut. I think these nuts are really good as well. All right, so what do we have on the menu tonight? I'm really excited about tonight's recipe. My husband and I were watching the Food Network and we came across Amy Schumer's show with her husband and her cute baby. And um, we fell in love with this one recipe. So we're gonna give it a try tonight. And I'm excited because being home right now with the lockdown, literally I've become a little chef. My Italian and Dominican side definitely is embracing many different palettes of flavor. And uh, tonight, it's just gonna be one of those nights where it's a little sweet and maybe a little sour. Stay posted. And shout out to Food Network. Okay, so here's the deal with the Amy Schumer recipe from Food Network that I'm so excited to cook because I love chicken wings. And my husband's really not big into chicken wings, but when he saw this recipe and he saw that there was kind of like a sweet and savory aspect to it, it appealed to him. I'm a New Yorker and I married a man that's from the Midwest, so he loves meat. So any way that I can doctor up flavoring my meat, he's all about. So the ingredients call for about, I would say six pounds of chicken wings. It's just my husband and I, so I'm gonna use about three pounds. And the ingredients, I'm gonna reduce down to half the size. So if something's two servings of it, I'm gonna do one serving of it. We have soy sauce. I have low sodium. Um, to me, it's just better for me. I feel like I digest it better. I love soy sauce, but I try not to eat too much of it. It can kind of make you feel a little bloated, so that's why, in general, I'm probably gonna reduce everything down a little. I'm usually gonna reduce any soy sauce that's called for my recipe down a little bit just because I know how I work with me eating soy sauce. And then it calls for honey. And it calls for white wine vinegar. It calls for, you put the lime in the coconut, and it calls for a couple other ingredients, so you can check that out on thefoodnetwork.com. And, you know, I'll definitely post more information about it down below <laughs> with some of my um, information about this recipe. But um, the first 30 minutes, you have it cooked on one side, and then you flip it over the other 30 minutes, and you put it on um, a sheet rack with tin foil. And I'm gonna make some sides, vegetables all the way, zucchini steamed, then I'll saute it with some garlic and some maybe some butter or olive oil and I'm making it with some sweet corn on the side. So stay posted. I'll uh, be showing you how my cooking process is going throughout uh, this evening and I'll show you the final result. Okay, so I have about two and a half pounds of chicken wings. The recipe actually calls for five pounds, not six. So my bad. And they look really yummy. Um, it does call for like a yogurt sauce, right? I'm very specific on my dairy, so I probably would use that sauce recipe on the side. I don't think I'm gonna use it right now. This, I'm gonna add some water and steam zucchinis and then add some garlic to it a little later. And then I have sweet corn with my, I'm sorry, I gotta have my little butter, but I have soy feet butter. I always do that, soy feet. <laughs> soy feet butter from Earth Balance. And definitely, um, pam it up, pam it up. Otherwise it'll stick to the uh, aluminum foil. All right, I'll be back. 400 in the oven. This is the grand finale on my solo paper plate. Cooking with Elisa. Shout out to Team Network, Amy Schumer's yummy wing recipe. Shout out to her husband that basically just helped concoct an amazing recipe that I'm about to grub. I'm a little burnt. My oven gets a little high at times, but I'm excited. Um, so yeah, I'll show a finale picture. I'm gonna go eat with my husband. Love and night.